guys, welcome back. Today we're going to show you how to use the jar of attachments on our food saver. We have two sizes. We have a wide mouth and we have a regular mouth. It's very simple to use. First off, you're going to need a flat for your, for your jar. And then you can pull out your hose. Mine comes attached and it's got this thing for another thing. You turn that on. Maybe not. And then we're going to turn on attachment. Anyway, slide this on there. Hook this up there. Then hit your attachment button. Let it go. I already put the jars at the same time. Make that loud noise until it's done getting all the air out. Okay, now it's done. So you can pop this off, pop your hose off. Be very careful and pull this off. Check it, okay? It's down, it's vacuum sealed. Now that chop that I put in there should last six months to a year before it starts turning white. Now, on the small mouth ones, you do the same thing, except you use a small mouth attachment. Put it on there. Attach this. Get your attachment button. Okay, now that lid didn't stay on there. Try a different lid. Sometimes you'll have that problem. That's okay. Little blue seal came out. Stick it back in there. No big deal. All right, let's try this again. All right. These food savers, they're really handy. Save you can buy chicken stuff in box, it still doesn't work. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna try a double layer. Sometimes that works. Okay. Could be the jar. Alright, let's try it one more time with the double lid. Sometimes that works. Not 100 percent bumper. Cross your fingers. Let's see if that one worked. Yeah, see? Sometimes you put two on there, the top one on and the bottom one will. See? So just remember that if you have a problem with them sealing. Then I use the rings to keep it just kind of top down. Right, that's it. Now, I've got another neat thing for you. <laughs> you get these jars you buy at Walmart. And uh, any other grocery store that you can reuse. This one had salsa in it. I put some Valentine candy in it. Now these these won't fit on them, okay? You don't want them to. Know. So what am I going to do here? This neat little thing. I got these here containers here, different sizes. See that? I got lids. That ain't, I don't know. Find that the seal off. Let's see. Okay, it works. But you can use dip these for different size jars. You can recycle these jars instead of um, throwing them out and stuff. 
I'm going to use and waste some Kate Nichols in there. It's got a hole in it just like the other ones. Turn it on. This takes a little longer than these. This is a little tricky. I don't know if you'll be able to hear it or not. But when that's done, okay, you got this little gray button here. I'll try to get close. Maybe you can hear it. You'll hear a, a, a section noise when you push on it. You hear that? That's sucking the rest of it. You take it out. And it's sealed. Anyway, right. that's how you use those jars. Like I said, it's really good for dry goods or if you buy stuff on clearance after the holidays, like candy. I sell, I, I get a lot of candy real cheap. I sealed up in jars and the kids know they can. Go get whatever they want. It's, it's, that's about it. So tell me what you think. Have, give it a try. Bye bye.